Alex, the GET marching band found out over a year ago that they will be representing Wisconsin in the Pearl Harbor Memorial Parade. And with the help of the community, they spent that time fundraising to make this trip happen. How they pay it back, you ask? Well, doing what they do best. Caitlin Cook and the GET marching band is used to performing in front of crowds, as you see here. But nothing compares to the crowd that their next performance will draw in Honolulu. Where we'll be performing for the um, Pearl Harbor Memorial Parade. The Pearl Harbor Memorial Parade takes place every year on December 7th, the anniversary of the Pearl Harbor attack. The purpose of the parade is to honor and pay respect to the survivors, our veterans, active duty military, and their families. Each year, one band from each state is chosen to represent that respective state, an honor that GET high school music teacher Tony Kading describes as life-changing. Music is about connecting, you know. Music is about connecting with your audience. Music is about connecting with, you know, your culture and with history. And this is a really cool opportunity for us to do all of that. Kading says his band was chosen because of their performance at the National Cherry Festival in Michigan. Cherry Festival gave us the nod and said, you definitely need to look into these guys and bring them out your way. For band member Morgan Amon, this opportunity is bigger than people may realize. I think that participating in the Pearl Harbor Memorial Parade, it's beyond anything I've ever done because it matters in a different level. It, it matters to our community, it matters to our country, it matters to our history. I'm so excited and honored. But before these young men and women board their flight, they put on one last show to show their appreciation to the community that has supported them this past year. Santa Claus ended the event by lighting the downtown tree as a formal send-off. And thank you, Santa Claus, for that. But... The support from the community extends all the way to Texas as a 1947 GET class alumni, Mary Terry, has shown countless support for the band. Coincidentally, her 94th birthday is on December 7th. The link to the webcast of the parade will be over on our website, news8000.com. Alex, 